yeah, yeah. So the messages I was getting for you guys was one of them was stop putting your energy into a person or situation. I definitely do feel that um, this person is trying to make you feel bad or trying to make you look bad or something like that. I was just getting that somebody has really bad intentions towards you. And I do feel like this is someone that either you are dating or someone that you are friends with. Also, um, another message I was getting was manipulating you. Like I said, I was feeling that this person is trying to make you feel like something's your fault or trying to make you feel crazy when they're the ones that's acting crazy. So yeah, <clears throat> sorry, I'm still a little bit sick recovering from all of that. But um, yeah, anyway, I do want to give a big thank you to everyone who has joined my Patreon. Also to everyone who has subscribed to my second channel. The links to both of those will be down below. Also, for those of you interested in ordering a personal reading, you can visit my website at swordstarot.com where I have different options of different readings you can purchase. Okay, this one is the energy surrounding Leo. is the energy surrounding Leo. Okay, so we got the Two of Wands energy here. Definitely feel like there's a big decision some of you guys are making. It could be a big life decision. Um, chariot card energy. Could be talking about traveling or moving. Uh, we do have the Ten of Wands energy here as well. So yeah, I feel like some of you are wanting to do this, wanting to travel, move, uh, whatever the case is. Or I almost feel that some of you are just on the fence about it because you know it's going to be I feel like some of you are sensing it's going to be a lot of stress for some reason or another. Um, I feel like a lot of you are just not trying to go through that right now. I almost feel as well something may be feeling rushed. Like the chariot card is an extremely fast energy. So maybe you feel like something is being rushed or you're being rushed. Um, we do have the nine of swords energy. So I feel like you're, you're kind of worried about it, Loki. Uh, maybe a little bit in your head about a situation. How things are going to pan out. Is this the right decision? And this one is the energy surrounding Leo. Ooh. Ooh, I don't like that. Okay, so five of swords energy. I definitely feel someone. I feel like somebody's rushing you because they have, like, negative intentions. Five of swords is not a good card. This is, like... Somebody has an agenda, someone has a plan, and I feel like it, it's like a hidden agenda. I don't feel like they're letting you in on, you know, what they really want, what their real intentions are. What is the energy surrounding Leo? Ooh, lover's card. Okay, could be somebody that you're dealing with romantically. All right. Ooh, king of pentacles. So you guys can deal with an earth sign. Two of Virgo cat. What is the energy surrounding Leo? Two cups. Hmm. Okay, so if you're in a relationship, your person loves you very, very much, but there is something that you don't know about them. Like the connection is all there. The connection's beautiful, but I feel there is definitely some things that you are not aware of about this person. Like I'm not understanding why the fire. And you know this. You know this because the Knight of Swords energy, you're picking up on it. You feel it. Okay. Yeah, this move. Nine of Wands. So maybe some of you guys are going to be moving in together. If you don't already live together. Hmm, okay, yeah, we got to get deeper into this. Because it's weird. It's such a conflicting energy. Like, oh, yes, Two of Cups, Lover's Card. You guys have a strong connection. It's beautiful. And then it's like on the other side, you have this energy. Like, swords everywhere, bitch. People getting hurt. People crying. Like, yeah, no, we got we to gotta see what this is about. Okay. Yeah, I do feel like it's regarding this travel or regarding this move or regarding, like, a big decision. So, like, maybe you guys are moving in together or whatever, but I feel like this is regarding a big decision that you're just, like, you're not sure if it's just right with you. Why is the Ten of Wands energy here? So, the Ten of Wands, this is something being a lot, something being real stressful. Um, yeah, it's just... A difficult energy to deal with. Yeah, nine of wands and the five of, ooh, five of pentacles. Okay, maybe you feel this is a bad financial decision. So yeah, like I said, the connection here is very strong, um, but maybe you and your partner feel like this is a bad financial situation. The thing is, the fact that the energy, you know, of course we'll see the outcome. We'll see how, how that is. But I feel like Five of Pentacles, some of you guys are concerned about finances. Like, should we do this? Should we buy this right now? Why is the chariot card energy here? Okay. Page of Pentacles and the Six of Wands. All right. So, I mean, 
whatever the decision is, it doesn't seem like it's going to go like that bad, like as far as finances and things like that. I do feel though, Page of Pentacles, this is going to be a lesson for you or possibly the two of you. Because I don't know, something, I just feel like something is not sitting right with you. Why is the Page of Pentacles here? Why is the Page of Pentacles here? Okay, so you're scared that you're not going to like it. Maybe you're somebody that's very independent. You're like, oh, move in with me. Maybe you're not sure about that. Yeah, I, de I definitely feel like you want to take the offer because, you know, you love this person. But also, I feel like you know yourself as well. I don't know. So you're very on the fence about this. And you have the right to be because I, I still feel someone's intentions are off here. Why is the lover's card energy? Eight of Wands. Yeah, there's like there's like three cards that represent travel, represent moving. So a lot of you guys are doing that right now. Or I feel like a lot of you guys will be doing that in the future. Um, they want to move. I feel like this is your partner. They want to move. They want things to move forward quicker as well. Maybe more on the Eight of Wands energy. Yeah, this person moves so fast. Knight of Swords, Chariot card. Why are they moving so quickly? Like they will, okay, all right, listen. This person, the person that you're dealing with, the reason that they want to go or the reason that they want to move, they're running away from something. Like I feel like they're not telling you fully what it is, but the reason they want to go so bad and right now is because they're running away from something. Why is the Five of Swords energy here? Why is the Five of Swords energy here? Hmm. I want to say they're running away from someone. Oh. Okay, so I feel like this has to do with you. Oh my God. This person, okay, I feel like they, they want to put, this is going to sound so weird. They want to put you on a different path or they want to put you, oh, this is weird. They're telling, they're explaining this so weird. Uh, five of wands in the bottom of the deck. They want, yeah, they want you on a different path. They want to like, I almost want to say they, I want to go as far as say they want to control what you do. Like I, that sounds, that just sounds insane, but I really feel that's what's going on here. Give me more of the Five of Swords energy. Judgment. Okay, so the fact that judgment is here, you intuitively, you already know this. I, I really am feeling the fact that judgment's here, you got to reconsider your decision. Give me more of the judgment card of the Five of Swords. Give me more of the Judgment card and the Five of Swords. Hmm. Okay, Six of Cups. Damn. Like, okay, this is so weird. Because, like, I feel like everything's fine. Like, you don't... You don't know why you have this bad feeling. Because I feel like this is this dinosaur, this is your energy. You're the one that has this bad feeling, but it's like on the outside, everything's cool. Six of Pentacles, you know, things are going good financially. Sun card, you guys are happy. Ace of Pentacles, the money's there. Six of Cups, the connection's there. But it's like something, it, it just something, some ain't right. Like regardless of everything looking nice, something is not right. Why is the Nine of Swords energy? And I feel you, because something ain't right. Some, yeah, something needs to be healed. Star car energy. Why is the Nine of Swords here? Okay. So maybe you feel that there's something that this person's holding back. Why is the Four of Pentacles here? Okay, so I'll, okay, so I'm getting yeah, maybe things are cool on the outside, maybe things are cool, um, you know, whatever. But I definitely feel maybe this person is not giving you what they need or what you need in the relationship. Maybe as far as intimacy, whatever. Um, 
Maybe they're unemotional in the relationship. But something's wrong. Or maybe you feel like they're lying to you. Seven of Swords. Maybe you feel like they're lying to you about something. The fact that the Seven of Swords is here is very well could be. Why is the Seven of Swords here? Ooh, okay. Yeah. There's some drama. There's some drama going on. Whether this is, you know, with friends, family, whatever it is. The, uh, like I said, this person's running away from something. And I feel like they're trying to take you with them. And they have no intention of telling you what's going on. Literally none. But I do feel like this person may be, may be in some trouble. Or maybe running from some people. Hmm, that's, that's very interesting. I feel like this reading is probably only for a couple of you. Because this is like very specific, but... Yeah, ooh. Okay, so the fact, just going back to judgment, the fact that this is here, listen to your intuition. That's all I have to say about this reading. Listen to your intuition because you're right. It's difficult because I feel like this person puts on a really good show. A really good show. Like, oh yeah, things are going to be fine, babe. Like, everything's good. And, you know, I feel like you know that there's something more going on. Like, they're rushing for a reason. So yeah, anyway, I do hope that this reading was helpful for you guys. If you would like a personal reading, you can visit my website at swordstarot.com and I hope you guys have a wonderful rest of your day.